Hi, you guys. I am here with a Joann's uh, Fabric and Crafts. I think is the name of the store now. Store. They had a 60% off one item coupon that came out. So I decided I was going to do that. Um, and here are the things that I purchased. Now, of course, I only got 60% off one item. The item that I chose was this pack of 10, 10 by 10 square canvases. Super excited to play with those. Um, let's see here. Total I spent was $82.26 on everything that I'm getting ready to show you. All right, next up is a palette knife set right here. Super excited for them. Also, I got a bunch of clearance items. Uh, this was not on clearance, but this is for a specific project that I'm going to be doing for someone. Oh, yes. <laughs> I had to get myself some snacky snacks. Yes, some milk chocolate and sea salt cashew. I'm going to look and see if I can find any of these items um, online and on Amazon. If they are, I'm going to put associated links if anyone is interested in purchasing any of these items from Amazon. Well, if you want to use one of my associated links, they'll be there. And if you don't want to, that's okay too. All right, next up is the um, original Caramel Creams candy. They were on sale, so I, I couldn't help myself. I mean, I could help myself, but I chose not to. Uh, next up is some washi tape. Now, this was on clearance for $4.97, and I thought it was really cute. It's um, some black and white different washi tape here. Let me take it out of the package. So I can show you guys. Yeah, I thought these were a very cute, cute washi tape. And that is a uh, Tim Holtz washi tape right there. Which actually, I'm going to leave it in its packaging for now. So I do not forget later what brand this was. Make it easier. Next, I got some, these are die cut stickers with the alphabet. Thought they were cute. I have some specific projects that I had in mind when I saw these things and thought, mm, I could use this for that. Some Brilliance uh, Tessinko. These were on clearance for $4.97 and these are, um, the ink I like the shape of these because I've seen people do specific things with that shape ink pads so I want to give that a try also on clearance for $4.97 was two ink sprays delusion sprays it looks like they have a green one in here and a blue one as you can see the blue one is kind of scary looking it I don't know how that one's gonna work but we're gonna find out um, on clearance was some burlap burlap wrapped canvases and these were um, two for $3.97. I got two packs, one pack for myself, one pack for one of my housemates who also does art. So these are going to be really fun um, to create on and I think I'll do at least one video created on on the cool burlap. And this is, uh, yes, this is a Tim Holtz product as well. This is a Hero Art stencil pair for $3.97. It's two different stencils, stencils. This one and then this one. So flowery, leafy. Thought they were cute. This is a Tim Holtz stencil. This is called Holiday Knit. It looks very much like what you would see um, on a holiday sweater. Thought it was very cute. I didn't know it was the one Here the is day. another pack of washi tape. And it was for clearance for $2.97, but I'm sorry it's kind of covering up the brand. Oh, S and or K E Company. K E Company. And it's one floral one and then one that's kind of um, a cool color. I know you can't really see it. And, I got the tape. 
Kind of. Mm, sorry, I know, there's a bit of a glare. Next up are two packs of stickers. These were both in the clearance. Chalk It Now, that's the name of this brand, Chalk It Now. Um, these are die cut stickers. And it just has different household items and some kitty cats and a pig and a bird and you know, just various random stickers. And then this one was cute, it just has some Disney characters and this one was on clearance for 97 cents. I thought the Disney characters are super, super cute. Also, I got a Tim Holtz sticker. This is called Stripes. I like this one. I thought it was nice and I have some good ideas for this. Same with this one. I thought this was a nice one. This was also $3.97 as was the one that's called Stripes. This one's called Measured and it's Tim Holtz. Now this is a Tim Holtz uh, salvage stickers. It's called Crowded Attic. And I thought it had some really cute ones that I'm gonna be having fun putting on um, some projects and also some happy mail. So I'm looking forward to that as well. And we just have a couple more things here. This is called Musings Journal. And this was uh, this is by the Chalk It Now company, and this was a dollar ninety seven on clearance. That is cute. And it looks like, yeah, it looks like there's three different journals in here, so that so, works. And then this I was kind of excited about. This is the adhesive cork. This was on clearance for three ninety seven, and it's got fifteen sheets in it. Is from uh, DCWV, I guess is the name of the company. But it's um, six by six and it is adhesive on the back and it's corkboard on the front. So I was thinking I could come up with some creative things to do with this. But yes, that is everything I got for a grand total using one coupon um, of $82.26. So I think overall I did a, a pretty good job. Um, with the things that I found and some of these things I'll be able to use in projects I have currently going and a few of these other things I have already a few ideas of things that I can um, utilize them for so I'm excited about those maybe tomorrow I will go ahead and dive into getting started playing with some of this stuff I'm going to try and make forth an effort to do some product reviews over here on some of the items and um, some of the craft and art supply items that I wind up getting. So hopefully that will happen here sooner rather than later but you know how that goes with life sometimes shit gets away from you before you even realize it. Alright I'm checking this coupons that they gave me but it doesn't look like any are ones that I would use at least anytime soon. Alright guys, thanks so much for hanging out with me. Let me know when the last time it was that you shopped at Joann's. Um, and is it a store that you frequent? Do you uh, usually check out what kind of stuff they have um, available? Or is it one that you usually skip? Um, in the past, it's been one that I skip and normally it would be one that I would skip but with a 60% 60, 60 off coupon off of one item I didn't feel like I could skip that, so that's why I went ahead and went there and did some shopping. Alright guys, let me know if it's a store that you to frequently go to or if it's one that's not even in your area. I'm going to put a link below to that store. I'm going to try to find and see what uh, these are similar products to what I did get. And um, if I can, I'll put associate links below. Thanks so much for watching and I'll see you in the next video. Bye!